So these are two of our robots that we use to play uh, humanoid soccer in RoboCup. In this particular case, robot number one is um, the goalie. So its idea is basically keep the ball in front of it at all times, and if the ball gets too close, it does the split. Yeah. Robot number three is our attacker, which follows a very simple, uh, simplified version of soccer. So its idea is, well, find the ball, walk up to it, kick it, and then repeat. We went to modify these robots to actually play soccer. So what we did is we actually um, we added a computer and a camera and a, and a hard drive and, and things like that so that we can actually run the robot autonomously. So there's a lot of rules in the competition for how we can create the robots. majority of the schools that are there for the people to compete have some kind of mechanical, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering component. And so we wanted to make sure that we could go there and show that we could actually build these robots and they could play soccer and that we weren't completely outclassed by these other teams. Uh, next year we hope at least a score goal, I guess. <laughs> we need to get a, a whole new system up and working, so it's we, we faced the challenges before, so it should be easier to get going this time.